Today on The Freezes. Utah is the destination and playground for many RVers and outdoor enthusiasts. When you think of visiting Southern Utah, you're likely thinking about making time for Zion. What if I told you there's world-class boondocking 30 minutes from Zion, free camping with a 14-day limit, and a pretty enormous perk? You guys have got to see these trails. They are so freaking cool. Today, we're going to show you the boondocking in Hurricane Utah and the Hurricane Valley. Also going to give you the locations we use to ensure we got to stay our limit at this amazing area so you can do the same. I mean come on just look at how cool it is out here. We are so excited to show you this area and with that being said let's join Darren and I as we locate our very first spot. just coming down the road and we're going to take the first spot that we came to um, sometimes we like to be picky and make sure it's the perfect spot perfect view we are still getting used to not having the forerunner but let's go get set up look at this i mean come on we're pretty spoiled we got the mountains the desert mountains is what i call them uh, we have these awesome views over here that little rock slab i don't know how good the 360 does but Obviously, we take tons of pictures and videos, but we're going to get set up good enough for a one-nighter. just had an opportunity to hit bike trails that were just right out our front door. This is some of the coolest biking that, that we've done. There's so many dips and burns and you guys have got to see these trails. They can do it, babe, but there's like, you can't break a lot. Otherwise, we can take this spine back, unless you want me to try it and then tell you. But you can do it. You got your helmet on. You gotta be brave on it. Be brave. You are so awesome. Yeah! <laughs> yes! Damn. Hey, I like that Jayco spot.
Look at how dusty he is. He looks like an old boy. I look like an old man. So now that you've been staring at Zion from camp all week, it's time to load up your bikes and check it out. Zion's very bike friendly and a great way to experience the park. The best place to park and launch from is the visitor center parking lot. The Perus Trail starts here and then it merges with the Scenic Byway. This will take you all the way to the Temple of Sinawava and this is an out and back distance of about 15 miles. Condors catching the early morning thermals. It's pretty amazing. southwestern Utah. If you take Highway 59 out of town, you'll come across Sheep Bridge Road. Down this road is 56 designated camping sites for you to choose from. All with views of Zion and the desert mountain landscape. You're allowed to camp here for 14 days. You'll have access to 40 some miles of biking and hiking trails that range from easy to difficult. Here are the essential locations you'll need to know to ensure you can get the most out of your boondocking experience here. Let's get the most important box check first, fresh water and dump stations. The first location is the Maverick, but you'll need to make sure you go to the correct one which is slightly north of Hurricane in a town called Laverkin. This Maverick has a dump station, but does not this, have guys. potable water. It's great. Can you see it all? The second location we have is the Dino Mart Sinclair located here. This location will have your fresh potable water and a dump station, also free for RVers. We've used both of these locations personally and can vouch for them. Number two are showers. It could be possible to find showers a little closer to town, but we found $4 showers at Quail Creek State Park. And you might be wondering why we use shower facilities occasionally when we have a perfectly good shower in our rig. And that's a good question. When you really like an area like this, you want to conserve your resources as much as possible so you can extend your stay as long as possible. If we can mix in a few shower days like this, it really helps us extend our water and achieve that goal. 
Oh, and guys, we want to give a quick shout to Over the Edge. This is a bike company in Hurricane. If you're coming to this town and you don't have a bike, call these guys first. We use them for a mountain bike rental and a consultation on a bike purchase here recently. These guys are top notch and really great with beginners like us. So if you're needing a bike, call these guys first. They're top notch dudes. We hope that you enjoyed this video and they gave you another option to consider when visiting this fantastic area. And if you enjoyed the video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel. Thanks again and we'll see you next time. Oh my gosh, wow! Whoa! Wow! Oh my god!